All right, let's open up this Halloween box. Hey, Bolo Buddies, thanks for watching. Full-time reseller. All right, let's get started. That does not sound Halloween-y. Is that a word? That looks like Christmas. All right, I'm confused. All right, so maybe it was just donated in a box that said Halloween on the front and it's actually Christmas. Um, I think this was a $5 box. Um, it's got like weird stuff on the tag. Um, probably just needs wiped off, but I probably will not resell it for that reason. We have this, uh, I don't know what this is, a wall hanging. Let's see who this guy is. Ooh, it's the guy from that Christmas show. And he is a Stuffins. So I'm gonna stuffins him in a plastic bag and put him in my freezer. <laughs> oh, he's cute. Um, it's uh, I'm looking at the material. It's a little bit, um, it's kind of sticky. I don't know if this is vintage. It might be vintage. So I mean, as long as you don't like mess with it, it's okay. So I'm definitely gonna. I'm gonna hang on to him. Do my research, check him out. Ooh, what's this little guy? He's kind of creepy. Um, it is made in China, 2017. I think it's one of those sun things and it probably like dances when you put it in the sun. Um, gosh, what are those called? Solar, solar powered thing. Oh, let's see. Whoops. Okay. We have a Jingle Bell wreath. And I'm going to donate that. This is a candle holder that's missing the top. This is tinsel garland. So, so far guys, this has been kind of a, a flop. Now these, um, the big ones don't look too bad. These down here look tarnished. I may pull these out and uh, maybe list those. It, so you can see it's like, I don't know, rusty or something. I may try those. This is another one of those um, solar things. Uh, this is a little, oops. <laughs> I thought maybe it's mouth move, but I just pulled off his beard. So um, those two things are just going in the trash. Here's more bells, but again, they're just rusted out and I'm gonna throw them away. These are in the package, uh, and it retailed for $1.49, and that looks like a vintage package. So, like I said, I think I'm going to pull out the ones in here that are uh, colors, and maybe I can list those and make some of my money back on this one. So, this, this box was, was not a great box, but that's okay. You win some, you lose some. Here's another solar powered thing. I I don't have any use for those. Um, this says made in China. I'll throw it with my ornaments and just make a pile. So he's cute, but no value individually, I wouldn't think. But I can probably throw it in a lot. Let's go into the next box. Okay, I don't know what's in this one. It's not marked, it's just a mystery box. So it comes in this nice green tote. Let's 
see what we got. I have tape stuck in my hands. Looks like it might be Halloween. Yeah. Sorry, I hit my light. Okay. This looks like fun. I love Halloween. Okay, I can't remember how much this one was. I'm thinking maybe 10. So these are uh, party favor bags. Um, and they're super cute and they're from 2011. So what I will do is I'm gonna take these and I'm probably gonna put them like on Mercari or Poshmark or something. And I'm just gonna lock them together and sell them maybe with this stuff. It's, uh, well, that one's opened, but it's called Decorative Shred. And you got black and orange. Um, this is a little candle. So maybe I'll create a little lot. These are kind of cool. Um, they are uh, spider web candles. Those are kind of cool. They retail for $5.99. They're not vintage or anything like that, but I could definitely maybe lot them with something. They're brand new. This says Boo Eek Treats and Spooky. That's kind of cute. Um, I, I don't know. Like I go back and forth, like I could probably sell it, but I don't know, I'm gonna think about that one. What is this? Um, are these placemats? Huh, those are kind of neat. I think it's a placemat. Kind of cool. This is Halloween light up necklace. And it's still got the thing in it. So I'm going to assume that it works and they're little ghosts. So that's cute. Let's see what this is. This is very cute. Um, I don't see any markings on it. Um, this is what the bottom looks like. Maybe you guys know. I don't know if I can do a Google image search, but I might try to sell that. I think it's really cute. There's no chips that I can see. It's like a haunted spooky house. I don't know, I kind of like it. I think I'm gonna try and sell it. What's this? This is just a little made in China. Um, oh, that's sharp pumpkin. I'll probably donate that back, but it's cute. Legend of the Dreamcatcher. Again, I'll probably just, I'm just going to make a lot, I think. Okay, so these are um, Celebrate Halloween Together. I feel like um, maybe they're new, but just know um, they're kind of cute. I might be able to just throw those in the washing machine and sell them. People won't care. I mean, they're in good condition. I don't know if they're new, if they've been used or not. Um, but they've got little spiders on them. So I think I'm going to wash those. Because I think, I mean, even if I put them like on Poshmark or Mercari, it might be something that brings somebody into my store. So we have this hand soap and it's by Simple, Sim, wait, Simply Pressure, uh, Spooky Delights. And it's a little, um, it's a little, uh, a ghost and it's sealed. It's brand new. It's super cute. Put that in my husband's bathroom by the laundry room. It's not really his bathroom, but it's when he comes home from work, he always goes in there <laughs> So I call it his bathroom. Okay, pumpkins for sale. Again, since we've had this virus, I make him uh, wash his hands and, you know, because he's been out all day. So I was really bad when it was, when the virus first started. I made him take his clothes off and put them in the washing machine before he came into the house. I don't know. I think I'm going to donate this back. It's cute, but it's just made in China. Um, I have no clue what this is. Uh, maybe it goes to what's in the box. So we'll see. 
let's go to this. This is Croft and uh, Barrow, Barrow, Barrow. I shouldn't know how to say that. It was $19.99 originally. It's still got the tag on it. It's kind of cute. I could probably sell it. I hate shipping stuff like this, but it's, I, I mean, it's new with tags. It doesn't look used. So I'm going to think about that one. Um, donate. Uh, this is just like a little, um, ceramic maybe Halloween thing. I don't know. Maybe I can put it with something else. What's this do? Um, I'm pushing the button. I think it probably did something at one time. I can't get it to work, but it probably flashed. It was probably cute at one time, but. All right, this is a Yankee Candle made exclusively for Yankee Candle. So I think it's one of those where you put um, a candle in it and then maybe something up here. So I'll look it up. I'll see um, what they're selling for and make a decision on that. It, again, seems like it's brand new. This is just a leaf. And again, I could probably sell it, but I'm just not sure I want to mess with it because it's not a brand or anything. Okay, what is this? Oh, decorate your pumpkin. Pumpkin pushins, five pieces. So you make your pumpkin a um, a minion. <laughs> I'm definitely selling that. That is super cute. Super cute. Definitely selling that. That'll sell. All right, let's see what's in here. Um, this is a garden ridge, and it's just like a little croft. Is that what you call those? <laughs> Maybe, I, I don't know. I'll look it up. I mean, it's, it's festive. Um, we have a mason jar spider web. Uh, it's got like a diamond on the bottom. I don't know anything about mason jars. But I'm not going to mess with it because I'm guessing it's modern. Now, this guy is pretty cool, but he is from Walmart. So I'm just going to donate him back. Unless I decide to, like, throw some stuff in him. Okay, I want to know what this is. What is that? What is this guy? Um, interesting. I'm intrigued. Okay, so... Um, Oh my gosh, you guys, it has wheels. Um, part one. Um, that says part two, part, uh-oh. Oh, this is part one, okay. Okay, genius. Okay, that goes like that. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to see it. Okay, so that goes like that. Now, um, I'm gonna pause the video and see if I can figure this out for you guys. Hang tight. think I have a bolo? Okay, so they're calling it a floating monster. It's by Tiki or Teki, T-E-K-K-Y Toys from 2006. So super fun. Loved it. You guys know how I am about that animated stuff. It's so fun. Um, I, I'm guessing this is just like something that a crafter would use maybe they could make something on it or maybe that's just it's just a decoration that you hang I don't know and 
then let's see what we have in here. Ooh, what's over here? This is a, oh, they're earrings. Pumpkin earrings. And it looks like the batteries are in the back. Um, yeah, I don't know. It says grocery store, 39 cents. wonder if they're older. I'm guessing those batteries aren't any good, but they're kind of cute. I might be able to put those in a little lot. I keep saying I'm going to bundle stuff and then I never do it. Um, okay, so these are Yankee Candle. I wonder if they don't really match that. I was thinking maybe they went with this, but I think they, they just hold like little candles. I don't know. It would be easy to list. I uh, wonder if... No. <laughs> uh, circle, square, don't usually fit. Oh gosh, okay, and here's the other one. I, my gut is saying just pass on those, but I'll probably look them up. All right, so these are um, a set of four candles. This one has a little pumpkin on the side. This one has, is that an acorn? Um, a leaf and another leaf. So they're just kind of like little fall candles. It's kind of cute. Maybe I can put it with this candle. I don't know. It gets overwhelming when you're trying to put stuff together. Uh, this is a, let's just see. Uh, oh, okay. So it goes like this and it looks like it's got a little light, which it probably needs, um, yeah, it needs uh, AAA batteries, but you hang them, and there's two of them, and they are, it's looking for a date, no date, no brand, I don't know, I might just, um, they're cute, but I'll just sit it down here for now. <laughs> Getting a big pile. Another little mason jar mug. I, I mean, do you think I should try to sell these? Do you think anybody would buy them? I mean, maybe. They're kind of cute if you put them together as a set. Oh, goodness. I'll think about it. <laughs> um, It's a little black cat uh, candle holder. And another basket. All right, this is a toy, mystery toy tote. And I get the tote. So, let's see what we got. We have a football. We have more Farkle scorecards, which I think I listed some of these already, so I'll just make a quantity too. That'll be easy. Um, we have Uno Dare. Again, super easy to list. Just throw it up real quick. Um, Springlings, springlings. I have no idea what a springling is. Do you guys want to see what a springling is? I do like selling toys, so. Oh my goodness. Um, <laughs> I wonder if it like pops out. Oh, I see eyeballs. <laughs> Ooh, springlings. Okay. You guys want to see what it does? Maybe you push a. Um. I don't know how to get it to spring open. I'm pushing the buttons. Oh, right here. You ready? Oh! <laughs> and it's this little guy, and he springs out of there just like that. I don't know. I've never seen one of these, so I, I'm sure I can sell it. It's kind of a fun concept. You push the button, and it... I'll list it. We'll see what we can get for it. Um... Word shout. 
Looks like it's a dice game. I don't know. I think it might still be sealed. So that's lightweight, easy to ship. I'll list it. What is this? Is this a clock? Oh yeah, it's a little clock. Um, it says, do you guys know what that is? They're like little monsters. Uh, Skylanders, it's a Skylanders clock. It's got on and off. Um, oh, it lights up. So I don't know what play means. I don't know if it may, it's kind of cute. It's a little nightlight. Um, yeah, I'll look it up. Maybe I can uh, sell it. Maybe I can't. We'll see. We'll see what comes. Are. Whoopsie. We got some bubbles. Oh, if only this was full of trains. Does not feel like it empty but it's a train case holds over 50 mini trains maybe there'll be a million dollars in here oh it comes down that way oh cute um i can probably sell this if i can figure out how it works maybe it's broke i don't know i'll look into it but um yeah cute Think blocked. Um, I don't know if this has been taped shut or if it's sealed. So I'll look up um, comps on it and see. It looks like it's some sort of like adult game where you try to figure out like what the blot looks like. I don't know. It looks kind of fun. What is this? America's National Parks memory game again it's taped so i don't know if it's been opened or not so i'll look at that i'll go with comps first uh battleship um looks like it was taped i don't like games because i don't like checking for pieces so um airplane bingo play in airplanes oh cute um I'm trying to I want to read what the back says here, but there's this thing on it. Uh, I'll have to pick that off later. Just hoping I could. I don't. I think the little um, maybe they lift open. They open. It's kind of cute, right? It retails for seven ninety nine. So uh, I don't know. I'll look it up. Um, dice and I have some dice but see how they have like they're almost damaged like the threes all run together so I'll probably just donate that back and then we have a Rubik's Cube like a Christmas one I'll just donate that back Trivial Pursuit um, I mean I'll check it but more than likely I'll just donate the games um i usually they're so heavy i just don't like messing with them so yeah i mean not horrible not great um some bread and butter items and i got a tote be sure to check out the description of the video like comment share and subscribe thanks for watching